The creator God is Yahweh Jehovah. The great Ahasha, the great I am that I am. That's who the creator God is. His uh, first covenant, the preeminent covenant with mankind, is the Noahide covenant. But God's personal interests are mostly in the secondary covenant of Abraham and the tertiary cover covenant of Israel. That's where he has most of his interests because that's where he's done most of his spiritual work in mankind, in those areas. Um, sort of what he's mostly about, those things. So as Noahides, he doesn't have a great priority on the Noahide movement terribly much, Almighty God. That's a prioritize on this terribly much. It's a minor thing to him for the most part. But that doesn't really matter. Um, God talks to me and the, the information I'm producing for the Noahide movement is legal information. We have a, an eternal salvation contract and it's, and it's honored with God. And I'm allowed to provide and create information for the Noahide community. So one of the purposes that I'm doing in life is to develop and uh, build Noahide information, Noahide knowledge, Noahide culture for the Noahide community. Um, I'm, I suppose I'm happy enough at Talmudic Noahides, ones who follow the seven laws of Noah, um, take an interest. I don't really object to them taking an interest if they want to in the Noahide culture, cultural sort of stuff that I produce in videos and things. But they're, they're free to read for all this stuff and look at all the videos if they wish to. It's not really ter terribly much of an issue. That said, it's primarily in the name of Karite Noahide faith, which is Tanakh based Noahide faith, so we don't really follow the seven laws of Noah. In our, in our viewpoints. But Talmudic Noahides, if they have an interest, if, if you guys have an interest, whatever, it's not really much of an issue to me. We're information for Noahides, um, primarily current Noahides, but we're also information for Talmudic Noahides if they want to take an interest. And there are there's a playlist for uh, Tanakh and uh, Israel and Talmud and Christianity sort of um, people as well. So there's a bit of information which they can look at if they want to. They can look at our stuff generally if they wish to, but the spirit of it is a different spirit to Christianity and it's a different spirit to Judaism. It's not the same spirit. It's it's uh, God's man involved with Judaism. He's not involved with us terribly much. Only, only a small amount, a tiny amount has a, a minor interest in this. Uh, but um, my purpose is, as I've said, my purpose uh, Daniel Daly's purposes in the Noahide movement is to develop the culture, to develop the knowledge, to develop the infrastructure of information and uh, culture and uh, stuff, um, you know, ideas and uh, all sorts of things for the Noahide community, to develop the Noahide community. Ultimately, I, I've been told there's a Noahide community in heaven, which is the community of, well, the old Noahide community from ancient days, which is the world's largest community simply because it's built up its population over a long period of time. And uh, the thing is, Earth is where you get your rights on knowledge, and where you get your rights on information, and you get your rights on life. In the next life, your, your life is finished. It's finished on Earth. You just go through the routines over and over again, the cycle of life over and over again with, with the knowledge you earned in your, your earthly sojourn. So the heavenly Noahide offspring, those born to the Noahide community in heaven, they just inherit their parents' rights. So what, what I'm saying is that they normally didn't have terribly much information in the Noahide community, apart from early information from their early years. Um, they know how to build things and to make products and musical instruments. So there's musical knowledge and things back there, which we don't know about. But uh, that said, what I'm developing. I've developed a fair bit of information now, a lot of stories, a lot of music videos, comedy videos, and religious sermons and stuff, and religious writings. And um, this is my contribution to the Noahide world. And uh, in heaven, they're allowed to take that information and to use it and to, um, to extrapolate upon it with their own knowledge to develop their rights with it and to, to, to use it as a basis for their own sort of creative products. It's only within the framework of copyright of my knowledge, the framework that it embellishes, the knowledge which it embellishes, that can use that and develop that. So there's, there's a lot more 
Angel Saga stories done by No Heights in Heaven than uh, just just my small amount. There's billions of stories apparently. Um, but it's only within the framework of the Chronicles of Children Deaths of the Angel Saga that, that I've developed. Only within those core ideas and the framework of copyright. Um, so my my purpose in this life is to continue on until until I die, developing no hide information and developing no hide culture. And um, ultimately, if if God wants to take an interest in in our covenant, our movement, and uh, take a personal interest and in, look into our movement. Then he's welcome to, and he's invited to, if he wishes to choose to up, to, to take us up on that offer. Um, he has a minor interest as he's, he's maintained, but if he wants to take more of an interest, that's up to him. He's welcome if he wishes to. So this this video is just um, just more information on Noahidism.